before? I can't help it. I talk too much. I cannot tell a liar from a preacher, so I tell you what you want. I'm saved and sick of this world. Safe in God's arms. God, give me this world in an honest man's arms. An ego is hard to stroke or easy if you know how to quiet it. Let a man feel his burn in your throat. I talk too much. I'm sorry I'm not sorry enough. I'll dance all over you, oh liar, oh preacher, oh daddy, oh your tongue lashing is never hard or fast enough. Mm -hmm. When you lie still, stroking your chalice, the quiet makes me rich. I am a lone dandelion in a field waiting. Come, blow me to bits. Mm -hmm. Still, you'll die this way, saved by the lies that burn like the ice water and alcohol. Mama sits me in to break the fevers. Our silence is broke. I'll doctor at Thrashy, telling anybody all my secrets. Mm -hmm. yeah. for Isola Wear Curry. In the end, Tarzan always get hold of Jane, and what I'm trying to figure is how he swing on them vines and know which one of them gals will hold him fast and not take him out on the wrong limb. How he land so soft like, not a speck of sweat on his flesh. Like the peaches where I come from. You got to be careful which one you bite into, even if it look like it's sweet as cane. Could be a worm or worse inside, grinning at you like you the unexpected guest. So when I went to the picture show, to get out the house and to stop by the store to pump for some work <coughs> or a smile or two. And I saw this boy and his mom calling him a king, Arthur Lusa, I think, mm. which sound like Lucifer to me. Mm. And when I got up close enough to look him in his eyes, he looked at me like I was common. As all the rest of them gals he got a hold of, like he showed sure and seemed to know too much about where I've been <coughs> and talk about a freedom. I ain't never gonna see. So right then, I knew it was him or me gonna take a stab at living another day. And just this one time, I chose me. <laughs> that was after a uh, CC fellow Carlo Paul on, on September 20th, 1958. I sold a curry, a 42 year old unemployed domestic, stabbed Martin Luther King Jr. in his chest with a letter opener at Bloomstein's department <coughs> store in Harlem, where King was signing his book. The doctors say if he had sneezed before the opener was removed, it would have punctured his aorta, almost assuredly killing him. Curry was diagnosed as schizophrenic and sent to Matawan State Hospital for the criminally insane, where she remained, I believe, for the duration of the rest of her life. The last poem is The First Shower or A Letter to the Father. Ivory soap lathered, your hands guiding mine. Such tenderness without desire. How to keep it clean. How to hold it like a man. How did you know, even then, I'd never know how to wield this gift like a blade. When to hold it close and when to turn it loose. Mm -hmm.